Hello everybody, so today's video, actually I do need to shut the window because you will hear that. Okay. I'm back. Okay, so today's video is going to be kind of a little bit random. It's going to be like an update video slash a haul. Yesterday I went to town, picked up a few bits. The reason why I haven't filmed in a little bit of time is literally a week, but is because I've got my exams coming up soon, I'm going to be revising and I am revising so I'm struggling to find time to film, that's why I'm sat in front of a window instead of my lights or anything like that, that's why the background is going to be different for spring because obviously I don't have time to get my lights down or anything which is fine. Revision week is going to be next week, I need to plan my revision videos otherwise I won't know what I'm on about so it will be coming next week, I did want to do it like this week but I don't have time so basically it's going to be next week but anyway this video is like a haul slash random chit chat about the things I've bought so yeah. I'll start off with the first and only clothing item. Um, I did go to New Look. This looks like a big bag of stuff where, which it is but actually I only got one thing from New Look. Everything else in here is from other places. Um, I didn't want to get something too much because you know I don't, I'm not one of those people like on YouTube that buys tons and tons and tons of clothes because I'm just like, you know, buy what you're gonna wear. So I bought this t-shirt here and it says Paris on my mind. Don't know why, I'm nothing to do with the slogan but I just like the colour. It's like green letters on plain white. I just love this, in fact I might even put this on today um, with some leggings or something instead of what I'm wearing. But yeah, I just really like it. It was £7.99. The only size that they had this in was a 14, but it's baggy and I can deal with, you know, baggy clothing. So yeah, really, really like that. And obviously, well actually it's not obvious, but I have a spring capsule wardrobe um, video coming up very soon. It might be my next video that goes up, I'm not sure. And I'll discuss kind of about my little capsule wardrobe, but this is a little addition to that. So this is almost like something I'm buying for my spring capsule wardrobe. So yeah, I might wear that today because I do really like that. I then got my mom a few bits for her birthday, so I'll show you that now. So I got her this little brownie. Oh yeah, she has already opened this, but I just said, oh, can I use it for my little bowl? Um, and basically it's a billionaire chocolate brownie. It's like the nicest thing you've ever seen. Like, look at that, that just looks amazing. So I got her that. Um, and obviously I'm not gonna get it out because it's hers. But yeah, and then I got her this little candle. Like these are just little things. This candle here, which is just a little blue candle, really cute. And it just says, a smile is all you need. Um, apple sour candle, but I love the color of that. Like wouldn't that just look cool in the background? Might have to steal that. Um, and then finally I just got her something from Lush. I did get her the most expensive bath bomb there was to find because I've not seen this before. It looks well cute. I think it was part of their Easter range, which makes me question why was this not discounted? Um, but anyway, it's like a little kind of chick egg thing. It looks well cute. It's called Free Rangers um, brackets orange. So there was like a pinky one, but yeah, don't you think that's just the cutest thing you've ever seen? But yeah, this is obviously part of their Easter range, but obviously Easter is gone now. Um, and this was like seven pounds or something. Um, but yeah, it comes in two little bits. So that's cute. But yeah, I really, really like this. So I got her that as well as a little thing. And I won't put it in the bag just yet because it'll take me half an hour. Um, where shall I put him? Let's put you over here, mate. Well, yeah. He kind of smells like really citrusy and nice. It's really good. So then I picked up some makeup -y pieces. The first thing I got was this Anyway Makeup Academy Custom Colour Foundation Mixer. And this one is lightning warm. And basically it's a little foundation mixer type thing. And it is pure white. And the reason why I got this was to basically mix it in with my foundation. Because my foundation is too dark for me. The one I have is this one here which is from Maybelline. This is the Maybelline Superstay 24 hour foundation. This is a little bit too dark for me so just adding in a few of these whitening drops is perfect. I've got it on today and as you can see my face matches my neck which is exactly what you want in makeup. Um, before I was using this though I was mixing together two foundations. I was mixing together the Ordinary Coverage Foundation and obviously this one um, but the Ordinary Coverage Foundation <laughs> 
The Ordinary Coverage Foundation ran out on me yesterday. So this is going to be in an empties soon. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, got that. And that was £3 from MUA. I then also got a concealer. And this concealer is a really, really cheap one. I think this is also from MUA. Yeah, it is. And it's cover and conceal. The consistency is rather thin um, and kind of watery. But it isn't so bad. I used it today. And it's for those kind of people that want, like, really... Um, a light coverage on their skin they're not there for the full coverage and my skin has been so much better recently um so you know my skin looks pretty decent so it has done the job um but the one i was using before this one which i did have to mention because it is amazing um is the maybelline fit me concealer didn't think i would love this but i actually do after i've used this one up i might actually rebuy this it's like five pounds 99 um really really good and the shade that i had this one in was the shade 15. so yeah this is a great concealer if you haven't tried it out it's really good coverage really good formula um but the one i actually bought yesterday which was from mua was one pound 50 to let you know then then sorry that's a bit weird um i picked up a little setting spray i got this one from mua this is the pro base fixing mist and oh my god i put this on this morning underneath my makeup it stinks it smells really bad it almost smells like sick i was like what the hell am i putting on my face um but obviously like that smell does go away after a while um but this was like two pounds fifty just picked it up the one i'm currently using to kind of wait until this runs out is the collection primed and ready one and this one i you know put on underneath my makeup and over this one's matte and this one's hydrating so they're two different ones but i do personally really love this one um but i just wanted to try something new because i like trying new things and then finally i picked up a new lipstick i got this one here from the collection and it is in the shade 22 cafe Olay. looks like this it's like a really nice kind of nudie lipstick it's on my lips right now and i didn't realize but i already have it in my collection this is the one that i've already got it does look slightly different but it is only because i bought this one five years ago um and now obviously i've repurchased it without knowing so am i the fool um but yeah so i picked that up as well and that was like two pound fifty but that's basically it for this video so if you enjoyed it then please give it a thumbs up subscribe down below i know it's a little bit random a little bit blah 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 but my videos will be more consistent soon and revision week is next week so thanks for watching i hope you have a good day and i will see you um in my next video hopefully goodbye